agree with you that I think we're in early stages here of of, of Gen AI and, and stuff, but that doesn't mean that it hasn't gotten off to a, a pretty a pretty quick start here. So, you know, let's talk talk about some of the challenges that we face. Maybe some somewhat because it has gotten off to such a quick start, but also just as something relatively early in stages of development. You know, I think there there is a lot to work out still. So, you know, as I mentioned as well, you know, it's it's certainly becoming easier to generate AI based content. Plenty of platforms out there, plenty of ways to do it. And there's certainly more of that content, but that doesn't necessarily mean we're seeing better content. Sometimes, you know, better is not better or more is not better. Um, what are some of the common shortcomings that improper use of, of generative AI or just mediocre use maybe produces? Yeah, I think the, the top shortcoming is, is sort of a failure to live up to a perceived expectation from the user. Um, a lot of people approach generative AI, whether it's ChatGPT or or Riley or another you know, writing platform, is that it's it's this sort of magical place that creates sort of what's in their head. They have an image of what's in their head and what comes out from the output side may not meet that expectation. And so we kind of have to take a step back and say, well, you know, the outputs are really only as good as sort of the input instructions. And, and people need to think about you know, the input is, is, can be a very specific and needs to be a very specific set of instructions. The thing about large language models uh, and the amount of data that are contained within these models and the fact that they are probabilistic in nature is that they can do these computations very quickly around what the model believes should be the next correct sequence of, of either tokens, words, sentences, etc. But for really what I would like to, you know, call kind of a a first pass, first version being this early, these models are very good at, at sort of guessing and extrapolating as to what comes next. But when you give it a limited input, a limited you know set of instructions, the outputs can can reflect that as well. Yeah. 